so it's like deja vu welcome back to my channel we are still working on this cabin stuff so we had made a lot of progress before um but there's so much to do so i was just gonna get some footage of what we're up to this weekend all right so what's happening here what's happening is we just got in because <laughs> We drove up on Saturday after the soccer games because that's part of life. And uh, taping the wall off so we can hit the painting first thing in the morning. Um, I was feeling like I might try to do it tonight, but I think I'm just gonna tape everything off tonight. And we're gonna do this a beautiful accent wall, um, a pine green color that I think is gonna be just beautiful that we settled on. So yeah, looking forward to that here in this room. Absolutely amazing. Okay, we are, we are one with the wilderness. Yes, indeed. And uh, I got my pocket knife. I'm okay. ready. You're, you're very, you're, 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 you're real rustic. Pocket knife. I'm real okay. rustic. Yeah, just part of the, just part of the real life. Very woodland. <laughs> oh, that's right. All right. When so, we drive around so this way, it's really gonna exciting crazy. because no. Grandma Sita and Uncle Lean brought all the stuff for so mimosas this morning, so um, we're gonna have a little toast. Coming. <laughs> right now, oh ain't nothing coming, but it's still, still playing. Okay, I'm still playing. <laughs> oh, that's great. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, chef's features for uh, dinner tonight? Sure. All right, our featured appetizer this evening is gonna be uh, four. All right, so I realized that I forgot to show any parts of our dinner, but it was delicious. I had the seafood bouillabaisse. What did you have, Laya? I had the fettuccine alfredo. I can hardly see anyone back here. Lincoln, what'd you have? I had Got the name of the sauce. Red with mar yeah, marinara sauce. And then yeah. Kofi, what'd you have? I guess we got. We had the calamari, we had the warm sourdough bread, we had the shrimp and the scallops, and we had all? lava cake, we had bread pudding, we had a fat camp. <laughs> I was just <laughs> asking <laughs> what you personally had. <laughs> I was gonna give some additional details, but he just kind of ran through it. I didn't get any pictures, but peppercorn grill is a high, high, highly endorsed uh, restaurant. Just high recommendation because the food's really, really great. And tonight we also had really, really great service. So now we are on our way home to just have a nice little fire, wind down. Um, I did get the blackboard chalk wall painted. Kofi got uh, the game room wall painted. We put together the side table for one of the rooms and I got through a bunch of washing um, for some sheets that I want to leave there. So we had a lot of stuff to do, at, but we got it all done. And plus we had an op awesome opportunity to just connect um, and have fun with family. So, and like it's got some dances for us in the back. But yeah, all right. Wait, also you did record a little. A little, a little. A little.
that's okay, it happens to me all the time. All right, so I wanted to give an update on the wall color. It turned out awesome. Actually, we were really concerned because it was looking oh so Kelly Green <laughs> yesterday when Kofi was painting it. But, update from. Yes, came out great. It dried, nice dark green. Did a second full coat today. We're ready to rock and roll. Looks awesome. Experimenting on how we're gonna lay this out because I need a really long dining table here. Kofi already has a nice fire going. Scott's just following me on this tour. Sorting it all through. So this is my initial run because I'm gonna set up a coffee bar here. I actually already bought the bar I really intend to use. This was just another piece of furniture that was left over from the previous owners, but I had gotten a lot of little tchotchkes and brought some teapots from home. And so I'm getting an idea of how I'm gonna set this up. Let me zoom out. So you can see that this is kind of the intersection between the different bedrooms. So this would be a great place to have coffee set up. Another something that we accomplished was putting together this little side table for this room, which I feel really excited about. I think it looks great. It's simple and it has some drawers so guests can store their stuff in here. Again, I still need to get rid of this monitor and actually I'm taking this to the kids' room. But yeah, everything's looking great so far. All right, so I'm looking here. I haven't taken the tape off yet, but the blackboard wall is looking awesome. What do you think, Blaya? I think it looks great and I think it's gonna be really fun for the children to draw on the walls because usually you can't draw on the walls but with the chalkboard wall. Yeah, exactly. So that should be a fun, easy craft and we'll have like a, you know, dynamic art in this room. Um, so I will remove the paint um, tape soon and see what areas I need to touch up and then clean this up. All in all, I'm really happy with the way things are coming together. The master bedroom, I was able to set up the desk fully because I got a desk chair. I had a contractor come to give me some estimates on changing the flooring and getting some of the work done I want in the main living space. And I'm just looking forward to what it's gonna be like. I still have a ton of furniture to buy. We still have a lot of changes to make, but we are getting there. What is super, super cool is Laya has crafted or basically designed this house in Roblox. I don't know if your kids are really into Roblox or if you have heard of Roblox at all, but it's this really neat um, program where you can design and build your own houses. And so Laya has a replicate of our cabin. And so I'm just gonna show her a virtual tour of the virtual cabin that she built. What's really awesome is she's able to kind of um, show all of the changes that I intend to make. So you'll see a lot of things in here that you wouldn't see in our actual cabin, but like this is similar to the flooring that I like or adding the barn doors. So that's what's really cool about this program too, is we can kind of take a look and see what we like in this kind of um, virtual world.